Venus Montgomery. I graduated from PHA in 2016. Today I am a Treasury and Trade Solutions Analyst with Citigroup in New York. And PHA has helped me to rise by instilling in me the value of being culturally conscious and has helped to shape me as a leader. My name is Tennis Paul from the class of 2009 from PHA. Today I am a resident physician at the University of Massachusetts Medical School in the Department of Internal Medicine. PHA helped me rise by bringing me a community of my peers who taught me accountability and teachers who became my mentors. PHA is my family. Hello, my name is Aliyah Mercer and I'm a part of the class of 2013. Today I'm working as an admissions and outreach counselor at Westfield State University and PHA helped me rise by providing an incredible special education program where I started to believe that I can continue my education beyond just high school and they really did provide a lot of endless opportunities for me. All right, my name is Stefan Jean-Baptiste and I graduated from PHA in 2002. I'm currently the co-founder and chief operating officer for Creole Essence where we curate wellness-based beauty products with ingredients that we source from my native Haiti. PHA helped me rise by really creating a community of peers that ultimately became family. As we were trying to figure out life, we really relied on each other to show us how resilient we truly are. We became global citizens by absorbing and, and loving one another's culture. The faculty at PHA really embodied the mission statement and made me a lifelong learner. And that's something that I try to impart on my staff and my team every day. As a matter of fact, many of the best decisions that I've made in life and in business are really based on the foundation that I received at PHA. Hi, I'm Doug Anderson. I'm in my 21st year teaching at Prospect Hill Academy Charter School. And I'm here to introduce a former student whose achievements in public service have made me proud. I've taught thousands of students at Prospect Hill Academy over the years, and there are a few whom I was more certain that I would hear about again. As her senior project advisor, I uh, was incredibly impressed by her dedication to public service, uh, politics, and the law. So I'm not at all surprised that uh, she has uh, had a stellar career in those areas. So I'm very, very proud to introduce my former student, China Tyler. Good evening, everyone. My name is China Tyler, and I'm a state representative here on Beacon Hill at the Massachusetts State House, representing the 7th Suffolk District, and I'm a 2007 alum of Prospect Hill Academy. Prospect Hill Academy opened my eyes to so much and instilled in me that being resilient while preparing for the future is one of the biggest elements of success. College was normalized, and that was a big deal for me because I didn't know very many people from my community that went to college and attended a university for that matter. Yet at PHA, I was on my way. At Prospect Hill, we weren't sheltered from reality, yet we were encouraged to be fearless and engage, and if need be, step up and lead. On my journey to college, I was curious, and my curiosity was satisfied through engaging with the, wor with the real world. So naturally, I gained confidence because my thoughts were accepted and nurtured. In fact, I was introduced to political science through social studies by Jeff Vogel, and every day I had the opportunity to discuss current events, which brought to my attention that my, my ideas were actually good enough to solve some of the world's biggest issues. Worlds cannot express how grateful I am for that opportunity. Today, in my role as state representative, I was able to work on the biggest education reform bill on Beacon Hill since 1993 to pay it for it to provide scholars of the future with the resources that they need to have a great academic experience and so that they have the ability to attend great schools like PHA that will help them gain the knowledge that they need to be able to solve some of the biggest issues that we face today in the world. The idea of preparation expanded throughout every day and every aspect of my life as a student at PHA and successful results is what it brought about every time. On the basketball court, hard work and preparation and time management skills spearheaded by the great Jack O'Brien led us to winning the MCSAO championship. And in fact, from what I understand, I think we held on to a couple of titles after that. Go PHA. I also joined a debate team with my math teacher, Dave Urio, and learned how to give logical arguments and increase my understanding of many unique perspectives of many different issue topics. A tool that to this day, that I use every day as a policymaker. And finally, on to college. With the help of the Crimson Summer Academy, I was able to submit my college applications on time and secured my seat as a tour scholar at Northeastern University. Long story short, 
I was ready to compete upon graduation. And that's important because here in the Commonwealth of Massachusetts, we have a huge achievement gap. And students that look like students at PHA fit that same profile and are usually at the end of that threshold. So with that, I'd like to thank the entire PHA leadership team and the entire PHA community for fostering skills within scholars like me who come from humble beginnings. Happy 25th anniversary.